very difficult to find. Never seen one of these before, so this is an exciting moment for the Brothers Wild. I cannot believe this. Yeah. <laughs> Can you guess what it is? This is it, our final day to our 2024 Great Smokies visit. We've had a great time thus far, and today we're optimistic it's gonna be just as good or better as last time's adventures. So here at the Jake's Creek Trail, we're gonna search the streams in hopes of coming across one of our target species. As usual with salamander searching, logs and rocks will be moved. So come along with us as we embark on our exciting Third adventure. Onward, Jackson. Let's see, can go over here? Nope. Now, the reason salamanders often hide under stuff like this is because it traps the moisture that they're looking for. So it may take hundreds of flipping objects, but you're bound to find something. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. We have a red salamander. Now, these live throughout the Southern Appalachians and in the Smokies, but they're not a very common species here in the Smokies. They're kind of like most salamanders. There are many of them here, just very difficult to find. Now, there's actually a very similar species to the red salamander, which is called the mud salamander but there are some differences. Like mud salamanders are the same shade of red but don't have any speckling. And mud salamanders have a dark brown, like muddy-like eye, while red salamanders have a golden eye. Wow. Oh my. What a beautiful Now this is my specimen. first time seeing a red salamander. Oh, I've yes. never seen one of these before, so this is an exciting moment for the Brothers Wild. All right, hey Drax, now let's see if we can get some macro shots. That log would be perfect. We got a nice green background too. So. Right. Mm -hmm. All right, everybody. Currently, we're gonna get him wet one more time to bring back his moisture that we took away. And we're gonna place him right back where we found. All right, here we go. Place the log back. There we go. Put some water on him. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Right. Well, there you go. The red salamander. That is very the similar red. to the mud salamander. Red salamander. I cannot believe this. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> what an awesome day this is. Blue and two line. Oh, God. Not to be confused with the southern two line. Now, there are multiple species of two line salamander. There's the southern, the northern. But the one that lives in the Smokies is the Blue Ridge Two Line. Wow. You see how long its tail is? That definitely makes up at least half of its body length. Is because salamanders like this will often make long jumps to get away from predators, hence the tail, which they need for balance. Okay. That's really interesting. Yeah. Well, there you have it. Blue Ridge, Blue Ridge Two, two line. line. All right, we're gonna let him go. There we go, send that camera down. All right, here we go. Woo. Blue Ridge 2 Yeah! Got a salamander. Here we go. Got a salamander. Yeah! Can you guess what it is? Nope, didn't think so. It's a southern redback salamander. Now we're gonna set him on this rock here. Very similar with the eastern redback, but not as common. All right, All right look at that. He's a wow, little guy. Wow, you can see where it gets its name. Yeah! This is a southern redback which is not a very common species. Look at this. Oh man, I wonder if I can get a map. There's also an eastern red backed up in the northeast, which is just as common as a dusky here, but this guy, oh boy. There, thank you. Let's see if I can get a frontal angle. Oh yeah, there we go. Nice. Posing for the camera. Whew. Okay. Common sound in the back. Yep, we moisturize and ready to be set back to the wild. Here we go. There he is, back into the leaf litter where we found him. 
Nice, all right. Okay, everyone, this marks the end of our third adventure in the Great Smokies 2024 season. As we hope, we had much more salamander interactions than expected, as there are over 30 species in the park, something you can't find anywhere else in the world. So we brought you to this location to highlight how great this national park really can be. So if you're in the area, you should try visiting the Cumberland Gap Trail and the Jake's Creek Trail. I'm Jackson Hawkins Kimmel. And I'm Jameson Hawkins Kimmel. And, and together, we are the Brothers Wild. Bye everybody, keep it wild.